head over to search and then type in percent local app data percentage. This will be in the description as well. Click on it. And then you want to scroll down until you see Fortnite game. Double click, click on saved, config, Windows client, and then game use settings. You want to right click on it, click on properties, and then make sure read only is unticked. Then click on OK. And then go back to the folder. Once you're in the folder, click on edit and then replace. And then you can replace the 1920 with whatever number you want. So type in 1920 on the top and then on the bottom, choose whatever number you want and then click on replace all. If you want to change the 1080 part, you can click on replace again and then type in 1080 on the top and then replace it with whatever number you want and then click on replace all. Once you've done that, click on file and then save and then close this. And then you want to right click on game user settings, properties, and then tick read only again and then click on OK. OK, now, so for the last part, once you're on your desktop, you want to right click on your desktop show more options and open NVIDIA control panel. Once that's opened, you want to make sure that you're on display, change resolution, and then click on customize right down here. And then you want to make sure that this is ticked, enable resolution is not exposed by the display, and then you want to create a custom resolution. So you can do whatever resolution that you want. So I'll be doing 1680 by 1080, and I have a 144 hertz monitor, so 144. And then you want to click on test. Your screen might go black. And then that's been done. Now click on yes. Now let's just wait for it. And then you should now have this ticked. So click on OK. Now you just want to click on it and then click on apply. So you'll be in your stretch resolution. Click on yes and then you're done. Just start Fortnite and you're done. If you have black bars, you want to click on adjust desktop size and position. And then you want to make sure that it's on full screen. So once you select full screen, just press apply and then you're done.